Hello everyone, I'm RecV5. And I am Sandman99. And welcome to Fallout New Vegas with Joe Smurd. Yes. And so, in the last episode, I pretty much decided to maybe work for myself. Yeah, you decided to maybe work for yourself, maybe. Yeah, because, you know what, I've had about enough of Mr. House. And I uh, don't really want to uh, betray Veronica's trust. Yeah, because you like Veronica. Because I like Veronica. And I'm pretty sure she'd be very upset with me if I killed all of the Brotherhood of Steel. Just because Mr. House is a dick. Yep. So, uh, I went to see Yes Man. And, uh, I've been following up on uh, some of the suggestions that he had. And so I've checked out pretty well every faction now. Except the Great Khans. So now I have to go to Red Rock Canyon and make contact with the Great Cons. And I'm pretty sure it's going to be a, they're going to shoot at you on sight for what you did to them previously. That was self-defense. They're still going to shoot at you on sight. I know, but you know what? What was I supposed to do? Just let them shoot me full of holes? Yep. And not, and not fight back? Yep. Hmm. Honestly, actually, I don't know how you didn't manage to uh, do it uh, the super stealth way. Actually, I think I totally forgot that they were there. Yeah, you kind of just walked in and solved it the way that you usually do. Yeah, you know, I'm I'm uh, big on finesse and uh, subtlety, right? You know, I am subtle, if nothing else. <laughs> right, right, that's what we'll call it. Well, I guess if there's nobody left around to notice you... <laughs> What? Did you say something? Hmm. Maybe? Was Veronica trying to start a discussion with you? I don't know. Well, she's gonna go and kill a thug right now, so you don't gotta worry about it. Does she run off ahead of me? I think so. Or not. Yeah, you just shoot that guy with your shotgun a couple times. Yeah. Oh, wow, like look at this. Yep, you gotta be careful. Oh, yeah, that's Grex. Have been less organized with motor gone. Good yeah, didn't we... What, did we extort that guy? Yeah. Yeah, there you go. But he must have been okay with it. Oop. Yeah, I know you extorted me, but here, let me take care of this thug for you. Yeah. Well, he did a fine job. Anyway, you'll notice that I picked up a lever-action shotgun again. And that's because uh, after I nearly ran out of shotgun shells that one time, I just want to make sure that that never happens again. Well, and you do enough damage with them. Like, compare your damage output, really. It's actually fairly close. Uh, the main difference between the lever-action shotgun and the uh, um, riot shotgun is the rate of fire, right? Mm hmm You know, like the riot shotgun has a much faster rate of fire and uh, 333 DPS and 11.6 times 7 for damage. Yep. Whereas the uh, lever action shotgun does 10.4 times 7 and has 131 DPS. Yeah, so a little bit lower fire rate. Yeah, and a little bit less damage base, but not that much. Yo, you don't tend to fire these things at max uh, fire rate anyways. No, not usually. Is this guy that we previously... Yeah, okay. But anyway, I just figured that, uh, you know, unless I was up against something particularly tough... What's going on now? Oh, Eddie's shooting. Oh. You know... I'm not going to bother with that guy. And I still wasn't able to, like, I was in the Lucky 38 there, in my room, and I still wasn't really able to lighten my load at all. Because I just can't drop anything. I have to carry it all. I mean, you could drop so many things. I could, but I can't. 
It's a compulsion. There's some kings hanging around over there. Okay. I think we more or less need to find a ring road around this place so that we can uh, head in the general direction of where we wanted to go. Okay, let's have a look at the map here. Yeah, okay. So I guess we're more or less going in the right direction here, right? Yep. This Jacob's Town. Where is this place? Over here. Way the fuck over there in the middle of nowhere. Uh, and you're vilified and there I'm already. Vilified there already. So things are going to go smoothly. I'm sure. Look, luckily I've got lots of ammunition. <laughs> I've got enough bullets to go around for everybody. I'm sure. <laughs> to this it's still that way. Why is it that way? Oh, because it is in fact that way. Yep. Yeah, you see, you're just a road <laughs> follower, right? Yeah, I know. Well, you know, I get lost easily. And, you road follower? You know, can't figure out where I am. You know, let's, we gotta have a poll in uh, the YouTube channel. What's worse? Road flower, or road, road following or flower picking? Well, yeah, but I do both. Road flowering? Yeah, there I, you follow, go. I follow the roads and I pick flowers. Although not so much in this game because there aren't any really any flowers to pick, right? There's, uh, like, you can get, like, the yucca fruits off the cactuses and things like that. And if you go far enough off-road, that's where you find the plants. But they're not, like, on the road. Yeah, but they're also not really of any use to me. Yeah, because you don't have the survival skill to do it. Well, not only that, but if they're not... You know, if they don't produce blood, then they don't really help, right? Yep. Okay. Yeah, about the only thing that the survival skill would have been useful for you is, like, making your own weapons and armor, I guess. Or making your own armor. You can take, like, those gecko skin uh, leathers and things like that and make armor out of them. Really? Yeah, I think you can. But is it decent armor? Uh... It's probably crap armor. Probably right? crap compared to what you got now, but... Like, maybe at the beginning of the game, it would have helped. Okay, uh, I have no idea how we're going to get past this huge range of hills here. To be honest with you, I've never really invested in the uh, survival skill either, so I, mo I mostly just pulled up to uh, a campfire once and experimented with it and just, like, took a look at what it had to offer one time. Yeah, and then you went meh? Well, no, uh, it's just mostly uh, I play a stealth sniper character. Oh. Right, while you walk up to everything and go boom, I'm sitting there picking everything off one by one from a distance. Yeah. Uh-oh. Oh, it's a fiend. Well, that's okay. They won't last long. Oh, you went and flattened that guy. Yeah. See, the lever action shotgun works perfectly well. Yep, and the ammo for it is pretty common, too. Yeah, look at that. That guy's got ten rounds. You actually got a net gain out of this. Yeah. And some, ability, some uh, shells to maybe make more rounds. Well... I know, you've not really made a lot of ammunition in this yeah, playthrough. Yeah, I have not really uh, done the um, the ammunition thing, right? For one thing, it's just uh, something where I'd have to actually... Uh, you take know, a little bit of effort and learn the recipe. Take a little bit of effort, learn a recipe, maybe write some down, because they uh, don't really have a way... 
for you to remember what you know how to do when you're not actually standing at a workbench either, right? Yeah. Yeah, this would be one of those kinds of games where it's actually kind of handy to uh, just have a little notebook. Yeah. Yeah, that would probably be... Oh, look, there's some more. That's the wrong finger. I thought that, uh... I thought she died with the finger, you know, like, flipping me off. Oh, kind of okay, thing, but, yep, yep. But it's not the same finger. I guess that's the finger that she had on the trigger of her caravan shotgun. Well, you can always imagine that she was flipping you to the bird. Yeah. <laughs> hey. Oh, you're getting attacked by something. Morphines? Morphines. No, you're going to lose your leg. How about yeah. that? Oh, wow, look at that. I think we'll take cover behind this thing. You're burning, damn it. Yeah, I know. What can I do about it, though? I have to just wait until the burning stops. Okay, I know what I'm going to do. Oops, wrong thing. Oh, well. Uh, uh... You just gotta take something out there and shoot that guy. Yeah, I know. I'm just trying to find my stuff now because, uh, there, that's what I was looking for. Is that an evil Brahmin? It's a Brahmin. Uh. Search Cook Cook. Oh, this one had a name Cook Cook's Head? Okay, I guess I want to take Cook 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 Cook's head, right? She had an incinerator. She had some Mentats. Yeah. She had a flamer. Oh, uh, yep, you actually took the Cook Cook's head. Yeah, well, see, that's why when it said take her head, I took her head. I'm guessing there must be some kind of reward for her head or something, right? Must be. Or some quest item, now you're carrying around a quest item that you don't know what to do with? Yeah, I can. Oh, okay. A laser submachine gun. Alright, well. Now, I, I think I don't have enough favorite slots. Oh, maybe I do. Okay. You're gonna favorite something else now. Well, I was gonna. I'm going to favorite my um. Yeah, there. Whoops. There. Right. So I got my lever action shotgun there. My riot shotgun. Uh, Maria. Medicine stick, all American, old glory, 12.7 millimeter submachine gun. Okay, there. Yeah, that's a problem, right? I I like guns too much, and I carry too many of them. <laughs> yeah, you know how many guns I carry, man? <laughs> what, two? Yeah, like two. <laughs> Where's the fun in that, though? Maybe three. I, ca I carry three. I've got, like, my advanced ammunition one, my basic ammunition one, and my, like, conceal carry thing that I sneak into casinos. Oh. oh, that works. Oh, hey, you got ooh. another, uh... Oh, they breathe fire. These yep. Th these things. Yeah, that's a fire gecko. Oh, okay. Okay, is this a pass through here, or...? I'm gonna say maybe... Yeah, well, it's hard to tell. Nope, guess not.
about maybe up and to the right here? Well, I'm still looking for a way around here because it's just about straight that way now. Yep. Enemies on your left. On your right now. There. Don't see anybody. There's an enemy over there somewhere, damn it. Yeah, Eddie's detection range is a lot further than mine, right? got to be a way through here somewhere. Now we've come onto a road. What's this? Uh-oh. Uh-oh? I couldn't tell uh -oh. you. Where? But you're getting uh -oh. shot at by Legion guys. Oh. Okay. Maybe you've stumbled across some legionaries. Either that or this is just another one of those crews out here to assassinate you again. Yeah, that could be too. Yeah, shoot that guy. Oh, uh -oh. over there. Oh. You know, I'm pretty sure Veronica is using you as cover. Is she? Yep. Wow, I actually shot the gun empty. Uh, this, there was four of them, so that was an assassination group. Yep. Yeah, they, they come in groups of three to four. Yeah, you still haven't tried your 12mm submachine gun yet. It's just that uh, at range like that, I was just opting for something that was a little more accurate at longer ranges, right? Ah. Uh. Because it's kind of nice to be able to, uh, you know, like, shoot these guys in vats from a long ways away. He's got a marksman's carbine. Okay, I think I can use that to repair my uh, all-American gun. No, I think it's the assault carbine that you need to repair all American. No, this one uses 5.56s, right? So. I know, but I think uh, uh, even though the uh, all American uses 5.56s, it uses. Uh... Yep. Oh, no, I guess you're right. Marks I guess you're right. Carbine, yeah. I thought it would have been the assault carbine. No, the assault carbine shoots 5mm, so it's not the same. I know that, but uh, I was just wondering if it was. Uh... Ah, uh, whatever. It doesn't matter. Yeah, they were Legion. Legion assassins again. Wonder if that brush gun is something I can repair. Medicine stick. The medicine stick with. Let's find out. See, these guys don't bother to stop and tell me how much it's going to hurt now. Yeah, they just open fire. They just start shooting, just like me. Maybe they've finally figured that out. Yeah, well, I don't think they like you very much anymore. Uh. I think they have a mild reason to dislike you now. <laughs> yeah. I'm surprised that there's enough of them left. What's this? Ch chances camp? Chances map. Chances map. Who the hell's Chance? Mm hmm. But this looks like it's a map of the Mojave. Is it? Yeah. Okay. If you I say think it so, is. If you say so. Yeah, the bottom part there is down around where uh, Nipton is. Mm. And then if you look up at that tin can on the right, down. Here? That's Novak. You go down and around and up. Like down, 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 down. Go around more, around more, down. Down, 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 up this little side pass. That's to uh, Caesar's camp. Oh, okay. 
right? I think there's even a legion denarius on the ground there, and... The sun is killing me. <laughs> <laughs> okay. All right, well, whatever, I guess. Yeah. Uh, I don't I don't know what else it could mean, but it seemed pretty obvious to me that that looks like it's a uh, map of the Mojave. I guess it's just one of those uh, mildly entertaining things, hey? Well, who knows? Maybe there is something more to it. I just couldn't tell you because I've never been here. I just recognize the shape of the roads. Yeah, where the hell am I anyway? I don't know. Somewhere near where you need to be. Red Rock Canyon. Is yeah, you're still trying I'm... to get there. That's where I'm trying to go. Yep. But I can't get there from here. Ah, just keep wandering around. You'll get there eventually. Chances map. Looks like there's sort of like a little road here. Right? Like just... Are you still like hoping and grasping at the idea of roads? Uh, yeah. They're a handy way to figure out where you're going, uh -oh. right? Uh oh, again? Where? Oh. Oh, I just leveled up. Yay! What are we doing now for a level up? It's been such a long time since I leveled up. Let's, uh... Science. Yeah, science right. was, was science. one that you were working on. Okay, so we'll go with 75 for science. And then what? We can do a couple more for speech and a couple for sneak. What do you think? Sure, why not? Yeah. Someday you'll be able to sneak other weapons in. Oh, I got another uh, thing here too. Uh, uh, run and gun. Mm. Friend of the night. Oh, and I got an itch on my back. I got to grab the back scratcher here. Ooh. Okay. Um. Gotta love getting old. Yeah. Okay, gunslinger. Okay, reloading bench. Okay, commando. That one significantly increases my accuracy in VATS when using a rifle or similar two-handed weapon. I wonder if that would stack with, like, the lever-action shotgun or something. I have no idea. Hmm. Quick draw. Grounder. Yes, Grounder was one you had looked at back when you were having your ammo shortage, but I guess that's not a problem now. Yeah. Vanessa perk, you have a higher chance to score a critical hit on an opponent. Equivalent to five extra points of luck. Math Wrath. Okay, reduces all AP costs by 10%. That sounds good. Well, it might give you a couple of extra shots. <clears throat> yeah. Nerd Rage. Whenever your health draw, okay, yeah. Alertness. Fast metabolism, okay. Life giver. Mm. Oh, okay, look at that. That's kind of neat, too. Right? Yeah, Text. that would uh, very much vary your repairing abilities. Yeah. Yeah, nobody knows except you. <laughs> <laughs> okay, or I could get another additional 15 action points. Again. Mm. Lessons learned. Gain 1%, plus 1%. Earned experience per level gained. 
for example, plus 25% at experience level 25. Wow, so I'd get plus 32% bonus to earned experience? Apparently. Wow, that looked for that sounds pretty good too. Okay, it looks like I've uh Okay. Requ okay, it requires survival 30 for that. Junk rounds. Huh. Okay. I'm guessing I don't have six lock. No, but that would uh, probably make uh, getting ammo easier. Yeah. Oh, look, they've even got the guy, like, there's an old movie called The Professional. Yep. Was about a hitman, mm -hmm. and they've even got the guy with the glasses and cap like he wore in the movie. Huh. Yeah, what does the professional do there? Hey, okay. Uh, your sneak attack, attack critical with pistols, revolvers, submachine guns, inflict an additional twenty percent damage. Nice. I think I actually took that one. Really? Yeah. Mysterious stranger. Need six luck for that. Plasma spaz. Hmm. I thought there was also one here where I could uh, increase yeah, your yep intense training. You gonna work on luck? Well, I don't know. Um, maybe we could. Uh, see here dum, da, dum, dum, dum. could go with yeah let's do that I'm gonna go with strength are you or we can go with endurance gives bonuses to health uh, you just don't know half of what you're doing no I don't we'll go with strength so I can carry more stuff <laughs> okay well we'll uh, I don't even know what stats uh, influence your carry weight now I'd have to look again I think strength probably does I would think I think you've got the strength to use uh, old glory there effectively now yeah yeah you've got maximum effectiveness with it now because you have a high enough strength rating to use it uh, yeah well, let's see here. Uh, sun exposure. Okay, I don't have any um, debuffs due to addictions or anything like that right now. Well, there's not much left of that building. Nope. Oh, there's a little uh, shelter there. Great Con Armory. I think you found what you're looking for. Did I find what I was looking for? Maybe. Time to sneak? Maybe it's time to sneak. Ooh. At the very least, I'll probably piss them off even more, right? Yeah, probably. Great con armorer. Well, they're not hostile to you yet. No. Probably don't like you much, though. Huh. Not many get the favor of Caesar. Even Papa hasn't been to the fort. Like we don't have enough problems. Hmm. Like, we don't have enough problems. Yeah, it's like she said. Okay, looks like I can't take any stuff out of here. I think the idea is your problem. Am I a problem? You're a problem. Oh, well. Obviously, they, uh... Can I do anything here? Besides break stuff down? What do you need in order to make some more uh, shotgun shells? I don't know. 20 gauge buckshot, I need lead, uh, shot shell primer, 
pistol powder and 20 gauge hulls. So I need lead and a primer or something, I guess. I think you can find the primers fairly commonly at uh, uh, stores. Same thing here. I need lead and primer, but to make 12 gauge, I just need a little bit more lead. Here. Yep. Probably what you'd do is you'd break down uh, other ammunition types of other guns that you're not using in order to make ammo for the type of gun you are using. Oh. Right, because you can get the primers and stuff too by breaking down other ammunition types. Yeah. So like that 5mm, for example, you could break it down and get the lead. Yeah. And you break enough of it down, you can get shotgun ammo. Well, except that I need a primer of a particular type. That's right. So I think both the 20 gauge and the 12 gauge use different types of primer. The 12 gauge uses shot shell primer. The 20 gauge uses what again? I uh, don't know. Yeah, if you scroll down for a sec, you'll be able to see. 20 gauge uses, also uses uh, shot shell primer. So shot I'd shell have primer. To, I'd have to break down one type shotgun shell probably in order to uh, make ammo make, for the other. Make ammo for the other. Or buy uh, shot shell primers. Yeah, okay. So it's not as effective to recycle uh, uh, that type of ammo as it is other types. Okay, well, it looks like I can't really do a whole lot down here right now. But this is an interesting thing to have found. Yeah, and they didn't shoot you on sight somehow. And they didn't shoot me on sight, so, you know. And I think I found the way. Here we go. You know the way? Well, it appears that there's a a pass here for me to follow. Hmm. Oh, I think I see something that looks like a tent up there. Well, and I guess we'll see if they shoot you on sight. Yep. Got the hiccups, do ya? We have discovered Red Rock Canyon where we are vilified. You're no friend to the Great Khans. You should turn around and leave. And if we see you in the Mojave, well... <laughs> you mean you might accidentally get shot by a, a shotgun? Yep. Well, I didn't even get a chance to talk to him. Optional. Return to... Okay. Well, it looks like uh, there isn't really a whole lot that I can do. I can go back to Yes Man and tell them that I've made contact with the Great Khans. And they uh, really don't like me. I imagine if I go any further here, this will end up becoming like a huge gun battle of some sort, right? Possibly. With, with an unknown number of opponents, but probably a lot. Well, F5 is your friend if you want to try to pursue this and see what's out here. Yeah. Well. We'll just keep my gun handy here just in case. Doesn't take that long to draw, you know. They're not shooting yet. There once was a man of stout heart. What do you want? Uh. What are you doing? Uh, nothing really. Just trying to psych myself up to try my initiation. Again. Oh, what's this initiation? Everybody has to do it. Well, everybody wants to be a con anyways. They toss you into the ring there and beat on you for a solid minute. If you survive, you're in. That doesn't sound so sure, bad. Sure, maybe not if you're some hulking reprobate like Regis or big to the gills like Jack. I've tried five times and still haven't made it. You've died five times? Mm. Yeah. yeah, maybe you're right. Maybe I can find my true calling someplace they'll appreciate my poetry. Someplace like the <laughs> Do you think the followers of the Apocalypse would take me? I remember all those books they brought us when they visited our tribe. Well. Uh, 
probably seen their type. You think so? I mean, I'd go myself, but what if they said no? The cons wouldn't take me back, and then I'd have nobody. Hmm. Uh, okay, sure. You do that? Thanks. I mean, I'd go myself. He really just wanted to sucker no. you into this side quest. The cons wouldn't take me back, and then I'd have nobody. Hmm. I can tell you they're a bunch of big dumb jerks with no appreciation for art. I mean, can you believe their initiation? Got another questions. <laughs> sure. Okay. Okay. I need to get going. I guess Bye. that's it for questions. So I guess uh I guess you could put your gun away, then nobody's gonna shoot you out here. Yeah. It sounds to me like that guy's making things way more complicated than he needs to. Carl's been in a shitty mood since that big explosion at the fort. So, how do you tell where the leadership is in this place? All these tents look the same. I guess you'd check inside the tents. <clears throat> and try talking to people. Hmm. Hmm. Cave drawings of people getting shot? I guess so. I can't go in there. It's a new area and a new place. Yeah. It looks like there's not a whole lot for me to do here, though. Hmm. Well, at least not unless you uh, talk to us, because I saw another person over here. Guess you just have to explore and figure it out. Oh, there's somebody's tent that's open. NCR spreads its infection to another town, I hear. Mm. Nice eye patch. You like the eye patch, do ya? Mm. Okay, so, uh... I don't see anybody else with a name around here, though, right? Like, usually you want to find somebody that has a name because they're the ones that you want to talk to. <coughs> Maybe I should write something about how much the great cons suck. <laughs> Silver what? Silver eyes? No, eyes doesn't rhyme. Okay, Later. well, you know what? I don't think there's anything for me to do here. There's got to be, uh... Oops. Well, I guess you could decide. Do you want to wipe out the cons or leave them alone? Personally, I think that I'd be just inclined to leave them alone. If uh, they're willing to leave me alone, then uh, you know, I'm okay with that. Yeah, well, I guess you showed up and they didn't shoot you in the face, even though they hate you. Yeah. Huh? Oh, wait, there's another uh, little side Pocket. passage here. Well, you're either going to get shot in the face or not. Oh, there's some trailers. It's a trailer park. Red Rock Drug Lab? Oh. Where else to cook up your drugs but in the trailer park? My regulars. What do you want? What is it you do here? We keep the great cons from falling apart, essentially. Jack manufactures the chems. I organize the runners and the shipments. So you're drug We're dealers. We're supplying things people want in exchange for things our tribe needs. Don't uh. judge us. 
Yeah? Who do you sell to? We make regular shipments to a lot of settlements around the Mojave. A lot of our business comes from the fiends lately. Personally, I think they're kind of creepy. But Papa likes the fact they get all hopped up on Psycho and harass the NCR patrol. <laughs> 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 who's Papa? Everybody, that's, she's the second person who's mentioned that. Like what? Okay. I'll spare you the history lesson. Talk to Papa Khan if you want to hear that story. Things have been rough for a while now. Even with Jack working all the time and my runners making deliveries daily, we're barely getting by. Maybe uh, this alliance with Caesar will help, but I don't know. I don't think it's going to help. Papa Khan's been talking to Caesar's <laughs> Yeah, I think he's uh, kind They're of dead now. On about crushing the NCR. And nuked. Mm. Papa's announced that if Caesar goes to war against the NCR, the Khans will go with him. Oh, why are things so Red tough? Red Rock Canyon isn't exactly the most hospitable place. There's no food, barely any water, and nothing anybody wants. We used to send patrols out to acquire supplies, but ever since Bitter Springs, there just aren't enough of us left. Sure, what do you want to know? Hmm. Helpful? What, like bathtub stim packs? Uh. What's the point of that? Uh, well, okay, I guess I'm... That's touching. But it would take away from our bottom line. I'll have to pass. I guess I need more barter, hey? Yep. Okay, what do you have for sale? Jack handles the small time purchases. You should talk to him unless you're looking for a major shipment. Anything okay. else? Nope, I guess not. Catch you later. Alright. And you must be Jack. Yep, that's Jack. Why do you have to harsh my mellow? Just be cool, you dig? Yeah, what is it you do, do here? We don't like do anything. We make the magic happen. Okay, then what do you make? We make the happy stuff. What do you need? Jet, psycho, a little med X to ease the pain? <laughs> okay. Nah, kitten, more like drug suppliers. Yeah, other folks sell them. Diane's mostly in charge of that. How'd you get into this Guess business? I just had a natural talent for it. When I was a kid, these cats called the followers of the apocalypse came to our camp. They knew all kinds of kooky, scientastical stuff, so I ate up all the chemistry they could teach. Diane had the head for business, so we teamed up. Oh, okay. Whatever. So tell me a bit They're about their family, the... you dig? They've always looked out for us, made sure we had something to eat and a place to crash. Papa may look like a big, angry bear, but he's a softy at heart. Regis is cool, scary, but cool. The rest are all pretty groovy, even little Jerry. Who's Jerry? Uh, the other dudes call him Jerry the Punk. That's kind of harsh, though. I think he's just a sensitive soul that needs some love. He's usually down around the proving ground if you want to say yo. Okay. What do you think about Caesar? Huh? Look, kitty cat, me and Diane, we don't dig on that politics stuff, savvy? We just make the product and make it get to a good home. Sure, Caesar's a drag, but as long as we got each other, we don't care who the top dogs roll with. Okay. Have you considered you making mean, more helpful, helpful cameras? My stuff already makes people feel uh. rude delicious. <laughs> oh, I can pass a speech check. That you can. Oh, you're right. I should start a side project making meds to keep my aura clean. <laughs> oh, look at that. I just maybe did something good. No, I think he was already being sarcastic. I whipped was it really? Oh, maybe not. Already. But if you've got any more recipes, I'll take them. Okay. So what do you have for sale? Oh, you're buying. Cool. Well, let's see here. You could buy all He's the drugs. He's got all the good stuff. Okay. Well, we'll buy all the good stuff. Except for the stim packs, because we don't need those. Yeah, and then maybe you can sell him something in return. I don't yeah, know. Yeah, we'll, we'll sell him this banana yucca fruit. Whatever a banana yucca fruit is. Must have picked it up by accident. Somewhere along the way. And what else can we sell him here? Got any extra stim wow, packs look at to that. sell him? I got lots and lots of jet. Yeah, you've got all the jet. Yeah. Uh, well, let's see here. 
Well, I could sell them that stuff because it really doesn't do much good for me anyway. Bet you could. Yeah. Uh, okay. Give me a shout if you need anything else. Yeah. Okay. Um. Oh, you're bu Yeah. Okay. Let's. Uh, I think I have a few. Uh, I don't have that many, I guess. Do I have any of those super stim packs or anything? You no, could probably sell a couple of like stim packs and well, no, rob I, them of I, the rest I need of money. To, I need to use them for Veronica and Eddie, though, right? It'll be fine. Take it easy, kitty cat. If you carry like 10, you probably got more than enough. Uh, okay, well, this was of uh, somewhat limited help. Yeah, you lost a profit on the drug dealer. Yeah. Okay, so there isn't really anywhere out of this place, right? Okay, you guys are just regulars. So, uh, where's the chief? The guy in charge. I guess head up to the tents and look up. Damn it, too many syllables. Look left. Bye. Is there a pathway up there? I don't know. See? We'll go up here, I guess. Because and... there's also a tent on top of uh, that rock up there. Where? Right there. And then there's that little path oh, off to the a, side as well. Is that a path? Okay, maybe that's a path. Can't go in there. Maybe this is a path, though. Yeah, well, that's what I was thinking. No idea where it leads. Oh, it oh doesn't, nope. It doesn't go doesn't anywhere. doesn't go anywhere. Yeah. They just didn't have the technology to add that little phrase, you can't go that way yet, I guess. What they should have done is added the technology of acrobatics. Oh, well. Is there a path up this way? Hmm. Here's that I can go this way. Apparently. Oh, and there's something to kill over here. Is there? Oh, okay. Hmm. Oh, crap. Get the is big those, gun out. Is it those crappy things? I don't know. Get the big gun out. I don't know. Maybe we'll just, uh... Oh, yeah. It is those crappy things. Alright. We'll get this thing out. Because I'm going to have to go right by them by the looks of it. Okay. Getting your VATS keys all mixed up. I am. You okay? Well, she hasn't dropped dead from the poison yet. Yeah. Okay, that doesn't look like it goes anywhere, so I gotta go through here. I don't know, I'm getting kind of far away. Yeah, I guess this is probably just another long way back into the camp there. Now you're probably heading in the middle of nowhere. Yeah, where am I anyway? You're heading southeast. Into the middle of nowhere. Into the middle of nowhere, yeah. Okay. Red Rock Drug Lab. Um... Okay, well, I think I've exhausted all the possibilities here, right? 
mean, I could follow this path to wherever the hell it goes, but I have a feeling it doesn't go to any more great cons. Just more, uh... More Cazadors. More Cazadors, by the looks of it. As if you didn't have uh, enough of those. Hey, what are you doing? Ah. Hmm. I think that one is dead. It's just stuck in the rock. Oh, maybe it's. Oh, not. maybe it's not dead. Maybe it's just stuck in the rock. Yeah. It's clipping into the rock, so I can't shoot it. To be fair, I don't think anybody else can shoot it either. Oh. Can I shoot it now? Yep. How are you doing there, Veronica? Still poisoned. Okay, well, poison's supposed to wear off after a period of time, right? Eventually. So. Watch your left. Actually, I wonder if this thing's got enough punch to kill him, because I can get more shots off with it. Just moved. Oh. More of those things. Yeah, those things aren't so bad. Oh, what do you got coming up here now? Just some more of these. It's been a while since we've seen these. Yeah. So have you collapsed from poison yet? Nope, I think she's good. Mm. Well, we just came up to a uh, little bit of a lake. Is it an evil Brahmin? I guess you'll know if it attacks you. Oh, no, it's this thing that... Yeah, it's a bighorn. No, it was this thing that was showing up on the... I'm surprised it wasn't attacking that... that bighorn or whatever it is. Maybe mantises don't eat bighorns for some reason. Spring Mountain Ranch State Park. Okay. We just found Spring Mountain Ranch State Park. There's a fairly non-destroyed looking building over there. Yes, we've totally gotten sidetracked. Yeah, well, you know what? Uh, we're going to make our way back to New Vegas anyways. But so. we're exploring, damn it. So I guess this is probably as good a way to go about it as any, right? You'll hit a road eventually, maybe. <coughs> Southeast, northeast. Well, I can see yeah, the... Yeah, you can see the tower of the Lucky 38 there. Yes, I can. It looks like we just go straight at it. Oh, look, there's a road. Oh, God. I wonder where the other end of that road goes. Probably just to that park. Every time you say there's a road, I just shudder a little on the inside. <laughs> yeah, well, you know what? Off-roading is actually kind of hard in this game because, uh, you know, like, the 
they didn't give you the ability to climb up and down stuff. Yeah, they give you a lot of invisible walls. Yeah. In this game, unlike Oblivion and Skyrim, where sometimes it might be difficult, but if you're persistent, you can climb over even the steepest mountain ranges, right? And a horse helps here and there, too. Yeah, if you're riding a horse, well, then you can just ride up one side of a mountain and down the other, but... You know how I feel about riding horses, though. What do we got going on here? Poseidon Gas Station. Looks like it's half buried. A little bit of radi radioactive stuff here and there. Well, look at that. Like, barrels of radioactive waste all over the place. Hmm. Well, I wonder what rated this place to actually be a marked location on the map. What happened here? Someone is attacking you or something. Violet? Well, I don't know who the fuck Violet is, but Violet just, uh, is dead now. Yep. Well, might as well go check this place out now and see what's going on here. You had a hunting rifle. She's a fiend! She's a fiend. With Psycho. And the head. Okay, we'll take Violet's head, too. Taking all the heads. Yeah. It's amazing, though. You can take the head without taking the helmet. Yeah. Well, you know, we'll just leave the helmet behind, right? Hmm. Human flesh. I guess she's been feeding her dogs human flesh. Apparently. Yeah. Ammunition box. Yeah, you gotta take that 5.56 because you've got a gun that actually uses it. Yep. Yeah, and I, st I still use it a fair bit too, that All-American. It's actually a good accurate uh, gun weapon to use at distance, right? Oh, <laughs> oh bless <clears throat> you. Yeah. That came on very suddenly. <laughs> yeah. Ugh. Allergies there, or yeah. what? Oh, yeah. Allergies. Baseballs. Programmer's Digest. Here I should be the one sneezing. I was the one cutting up habanero peppers. <sighs> I thought I was going to sneeze again, but I didn't. Yeah, I cut my mic off right there in the <laughs> middle of a sentence there, because I was like, are you going to sneeze again? Yeah, I should be the one sneezing. I was cutting up habanero peppers earlier. Oh. The... <clears throat> what what are habanero peppers? Oh, they're like a small orange pepper, and they're kind of fruity, except they're very spicy. Oh. Well, maybe not very spicy. They're somewhat <clears throat> spicy. <clears throat> I guess it depends on what, what you consider spicy. If you consider jalapeno peppers spicy, then these are very spicy. I don't think jalapeno peppers are all that spicy. They're mostly just kind of metallic in flavor, I think. These oh. pickled ones are. I don't think I've ever had a plain one. Oh, look, there was another book. But yeah, <laughs> slicing up habanero peppers. Uh, hmm. So what this, uh, whatever her name was, whose head we took? Violet. Violet and those, and those dogs were the only inhabitants of this place? Apparently. She kills people and feeds them to her dogs. I guess so. Not anymore, though. 
Because I got her and her little dog too. Yep. Well, not so little dog. <clears throat> but shotgun does most things in pretty good. Well, I found two books in this place. So I guess it was worth coming in here to have a look. <clears throat> hmm. Okay, now what were we doing? We were going this way before we were so rudely interrupted. Yes, and thankfully you've been deprived of roads. It's a fiend. Whoops. Damn it. There. You need to find something that you want to use and shoot that guy. Yeah. Look at that. Look at how, e how easy it was. Hey, I gained karma by killing these guys. Yeah, well, they are dicks, you know. It's a lever action shotgun. You must have broke it. I'll bet you it's probably broken. Oop. Probably. Otherwise, why would he have dropped it? Well, it's not completely broken. Maybe he ran out of ammo. Who knows? I can use it to maintain my other one anyway. Yep. And now you got lunch. <gasps> yeah, what else has this guy got on him? Well, he's got some 20 gauge rounds. He didn't run out of ammo. Maybe uh, Eddie disarmed him or something. Right? Maybe? Maybe. I don't know. <clears throat> what is going on over here? Okay, pieces of a fiend. Oh, we must have killed this guy on the way there, right? <laughs> that would look like our handiwork. Just going back and <laughs> forth, randomly running through half encampments of fiends without realizing that they're there. Yeah. Well, some of the buildings inside New Vegas there look pretty fancy from the outside. Yeah, they're uh, extremely well lit up, aren't they? <clears throat> hmm. And then you got the good old rundown motel. Yep. I'm kind of thinking that uh, most of Las Vegas is in ruins and that uh, the part that Mr. House rebuilt is only like a very tiny portion of it. Pretty much, yeah. <clears throat> hmm. Uh-oh. Oh, it's another fiend. Yeah. It's like Attack of the Fiends Day today. Varmint rifle. So this one will have uh, some 5.56 rounds. Fixer. See, this gun's pretty good. It isn't a huge damage gun, but I've been managing to one shot these guys, right? Mm hmm. This thing. Mm <coughs> hmm. <laughs> Hmm. Wow. Going to have to take some more medicine for my allergies here today, I think. Damn allergies. Yeah. 
Oh, he's got a plasma whatever. But you just had the range advantage on him. Yes, I did. Doesn't even look like it's worth all that much. I guess we'll take his bottle caps. And his blood. I mean, I guess it was <laughs> worth 400 something if you uh, wanted to sell that for like 100. Yeah. I don't know if it's hardly worth my time. Just gotta get your bartering skill up. H&H Tool Company. Yeah, those are the guys that made your nail gun. Yeah. Wonder if I'd be able to find some more nails in there. Or our nail guns. There's a gate to New Vegas, so we should be able to get in now. Yep. Chairman and flee the strip after being caught. Wonder if they're hiding out in Freeside. I wonder if the kings are gonna give you another thanks for being around and helping us. Yeah. Thing I don't again. Know. You've been getting that like all the time. Every time you come back. Yep, here he comes. <laughs> hey, you're the one he who's been comes up and force greets you again, place. right? The king says to keep up the good work. He said to give you this. <laughs> wow, okay. That sounds tasty. See, so whenever you see this guy coming, you just start got to start backing away and running around the buildings and everything else? No, uh, it's never really a bad thing to, you know, like that. That force greet I can deal with. It's the one where the, the Caesars guy's you know, walk up and start yapping at you that bug me. Ah. Uh, because I can't even draw my gun and shoot him in the face while he's talking. Yeah, you can't take initiative. Yeah. Oh, we can draw the... Oh. That looked like it hurt. Yep. No, but, don't fuck with Veronica. But only for a second. Right? Yo, know, I guess if there's no brain left, there's no place to send pain signals to. Yep. That's right. She just relieved him of his pain. Remind me never to ask you for a painkiller. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's what Veronica did. She gave him a painkiller. Oh, she did. Wow. Another one. She's out there having a great time. Yeah, I'm totally unaware of these guys as I'm wandering through here. So, we'll go and we'll have a chat with, uh... Love how this place comes alive at night. With Yes Man? With Yes Man. It's hard to sleep in this place, I tell you. Last night, some girl was pounding on my door all night. Finally, I had to let her out. What? I try to... <laughs> all right. Who's this guy in the suit? Top's promoter. Okay. Oh! Hi again! Can I help you with something else? Uh, well, let's talk about the tribes Please I should get on. to know. Uh, I visited... Okay, they can be ignored. If you say so, consider them filed away under not to be discussed again. That accounts for all the tribes you needed to get to know. As soon as Mr. House is out of the way, things will be great. There will be so much I can help you accomplish. Okay. Come back later if you need anything. Yep. All right. Well, I guess it's decision-making time now. Yeah, are you going to shoot Mr. House in the face? Or are you going to... How do you shoot Mr. <laughs> House in the face? He's like... Uh... 
I'm sure you'll find a way. You're Joe Smurd, after all. It's what yeah. you do. Yeah, but... Okay. Hmm. Yeah, what do you have for active quests now? Um, well, I've got quite a few. I got that one, Cry Me a River. Letting Jerry the Punk join their order. I could wipe out the Brotherhood of Steel, but I've decided I don't want to do that. Search. Okay, that's another... Those are the Brotherhood of Steel, steel related quests, yep. things. This one, by the looks of it, is uh, where I have to go to recruit Cass, I guess. I don't know. Yep. Yeah, basically it's already done. You just didn't actually recruit her because you had Veronica with you. Yeah. And then that's one another uh, of the DLC things, I think. And so is that. And so is this. Yep. And I'm not sure which one of these is supposed to be the first one. But I think it's this one here, actually. So we still have a lot to do, even if we uh, do wipe out Mr. House, and you never know, that may branch into a whole bunch of new quests. Quite possibly. Yeah. What are we looking at for time here, anyway? We are at an hour and 11 minutes. Okay, well, you know what? I think we uh, will maybe leave this until the next episode. All right. We'll leave everybody with a cliffhanger. Hmm? Sounds like a plan. All right. So, I guess... We're going to try and figure out how to kill Mr. House in the next episode. All right. Until then. I'm Rec V5. And I am Sandman99. Have a good one.